Look closely and you'll find the word natural written dozens of different ways on supermarket shelves. All natural, naturally delicious, made from natural ingredients. When it comes to food, what does natural mean? Well, Trisha Calvo, food editor here at Consumer Reports, is gonna explain that question to me. Oh. Wow, Jack, what have you got there? So my big question, Trisha, is how natural is natural? On packaged foods, natural is pretty much meaningless. So you mean to tell me that I can be eating unhealthy food that says natural on it? Sure, I mean, look at the cookies, for example. They say all natural, but that doesn't necessarily mean that they're organic. And they can still have just as much sugar or calories as other kinds of cookies. It doesn't make them better for you. You mean I gotta give up my all natural cookie diet? I guess that's just how the cookie crumbles. So if I can't trust natural, then what label should I trust? So there are two things. It depends really on what you're looking for. If you want something that doesn't have artificial colors, has been grown without synthetic pesticides, then you want to look for the organic label. We found that a lot of people confuse natural and organic, and they're very different things. Natural really doesn't mean anything. Organic has more standards behind it. But if you're going from a health perspective, what you want to look for is the nutrition facts label on the back of the package. A 1990 federal law required nutrition labeling of most foods to let consumers know what each product contains. The labels contain percentages based on the FDA's recommendation of 2,000 calories per day. In general, you want to keep sugars as low as you can, mm -hmm. and you also want to make sure that you're looking for foods that are low in saturated fat and low in sodium. So when it comes to packaged foods, natural doesn't mean natural, and organic I should trust. And what I should definitely do is look at labels on the back. And make sure the ingredients are healthy. You got it, Jack. So while packaging can be colorful and fun to look at, what I'm learning is the back of the box is more revealing than the front. 